Hello guys, how are you all? So welcome back to another informative video. Welcome back to my channel, Deepan UK Vidcast. So today's video is about the TB test for UK visa. Okay, so this is the main medical checkup or medical test before you get your visa. So basically UK is very strict regarding TB patient because they don't have any TB patient here and they don't uh, allow any patient or any person who is uh, having active TB uh, to enter into the UK. So if uh, any of the visa like skilled worker visa or any of the visa which allows you to stay more than six months you must do the TB test if you belong from the certain list of countries which I will show you later in the video. So if you are applying for student visa or any skilled worker visa which allows you to stay more than six months you must do the TB test uh, before you get your visa and if you belong from certain list of countries. So the first question regarding TB test is when should you do this test? So the answer is it belongs to your own circumstances. Sometimes you need to do it before getting your COS or CAS and sometimes you need to do it uh, like before applying for the visa or you will already get your COS or CAS if you are in student visa. And the validity of the TB certificate is six months. So once you have done it, you should use it to apply for your visa within six months of the issue of the certificate. And I'll also show you the TB test certificate, how it looks like later in the video. So next question regarding TB test is what are the document you need to provide while doing the TB test? So the answer is if you are in skilled worker visa, you need to provide your passport, your offer letter and two copy passport size photo with white background. If you are in student visa, passport uh, photos and your CS letter. If you are in dependent visa, same passport, white background photo, two copies and they might ask you to provide your partner BRP card or any proof. But sometimes they don't ask also just the passport and uh, two copy white background photo is enough. Another question regarding TB test is, do you need to book your accommodation or provide your address details while doing the TB test? Because in the TB test certificate, there is a column where you have to put your address. So the answer is, it's not mandatory. If you have booked your accommodation, you have your proper address with postcode, you can provide it, that's fine. If you don't have also, just you can provide the location like if you are going to Birmingham then provide Birmingham United Kingdom going to London London United Kingdom going to Manchester Manchester United Kingdom like no need to provide any specific uh, address like home uh, home address home number and postcode not mandatory if you provide a particular area location where you are going that's also should be fine next question regarding TB test is what is the cost of TB test so in India some centers they will take around 2200 to 2500 rupees uh, so depending on your country i will show you in the website you can check into the centers and you can ask them like you can inquiry about what is the cost another question regarding tb test is do you need to take appointment for doing tb test so the answer is is depends on the center some centers you just call them that you will come this date and they will say yes you can go like come this date so no need to take any prior appointment some centers you need to take prior appointment and you have to go to the like particular date and time according to your appointment okay so it depends on the centers from where you will do it's not mandatory that you should take any appointment now coming to the main part what happens when you go to the tb test like what happens on that day so let me tell you my experience so like uh, if you booked your appointment or if you just call them that you will come that day, you just go on the date uh, and the time and you have to pay the first, you have to show your passport, your um, offer letter, maybe if you are in skilled worker visa, you have to provide your two copy white background photos and pay the bill. And then they will take you for chest x-ray. So basically TB test, they will check your chest x-ray. So they will do your chest x-ray. And on the same date, if your result is negative, on the same day, they will give you a TB certificate in the afternoon. That's what my experience is. So you will get it within one day. So another question regarding what if you get detected that you have TB. 
So in that case, they might do like normally if you are radiographer, you know it that for normally they do chest X-ray PA view. So if they have any doubt, they might ask you to come next day and they will do like additional views like any lateral view or lordotic view or AP view like whatever that radiologist preference is. So they can do some special views to confirm it. Even after doing uh, so many chest X-ray views, they are not confirmed. Then uh, like if, if you still have TB, then what will happen? Then they will do your sputum test. The sputum test is usually takes eight weeks to get the result done. Okay, so if you are having an, like any TB, uh, you have to give your sputum and you have to wait for eight weeks because eight weeks they will incubate your uh, sputum and they will see do you have any active TB or not. So basically it will delay your visa process and your entry to the UK because uh, the incubation time is eight weeks. So you have to wait for eight weeks if you have TB and once you are like once your results come that you don't have any active TB you will get the TB certificate and then you can only apply for your visa and now let's go online guys I will show you which are the countries on the TB screening list and what are the centers details I will take you to the website and I will show you all the details let's go online so just go to Google and type TB test for UK and the gov.uk website will open and you can see tuberculosis test for visa applicants and all the details are there you can read about it you will get each and every details who does not need to be tested regarding children regarding pregnant women so you can read all, all about it and then click on listed countries and you will see list of countries in alphabetical order and if you belong from any of these countries you need to do TB test if you are applying for visa which app allows you to stay more than six months and then if you want to check any country like india you can select india and select the tuberculosis testing in india and now you will find all the cities where you have the centers you can click on the city that you belong to and you can check what are the centers there you will find their address contact details so you can just if you belong from that city or nearby city you can just contact them that you need to do tb test and they will tell you whether you need appointment or not and when you can come what are the documents they need blah blah everything they will you can inquire about it so you can find according to each city so now i will show you how the tb certificate looks like here it is this is a tb test certificate for dependent visa all other TB test certificate will be similar only the visa category name will be changed. So I hope you have the clear idea regarding the UK TB test or UK visa medical test whatever you say. Uh, you have the clear idea now I guess and if you still have any doubts you can ping me on Instagram or LinkedIn. I will be happy to help you and please subscribe my channel motivate me to make new content for you help me to grow my channel and stay tuned for the next videos till the time take care bye bye